Hi guys, and welcome to the Wealth Startup Channel. These video series are about social media marketing strategy, tips and tricks for beginners. In this video, we are going to talk about one, the best media resources to get started with. Two, 31 ways to use YouTube for your business. If you missed the last video, please click the link in the description to watch it later on so that you'll have a full picture of understanding. Okay, let's get started. Chapter three, the best media resources to get started with. Facebook, reach your target market. Get in touch with over 500 million future buyers. Choose your target based on their place, age, and interests. Easy picture and text-based advertising can be tested and used to see what functions. Relationships should be strengthened. Spread the word for your Facebook page or website. Use our like button to increase the reach of your ad. Create a group around your business. Maintain control of the budget. Set a regular budget that you feel satisfied. You can change your daily budget at any time. Choose to only pay when people click on or see your ad, CPC, CPM. A step-by-step -step guide to marketing through Facebook ads. Learning how to combine online advertisements with Facebook ads and content marketing will lead to results. Google Analytics and a variety of other applications can be used to assess the effectiveness of the Facebook advertisements. Viewers will find the commercials less distracting if they're well-placed. Targeted advertisements would have a much higher click-through and conversion rate. Follow this step-by-step -step guide to creating your Facebook advertisements. 1. Choose your offer and build a landing page on your website. Before you begin running Facebook advertisements, you must first create a landing page that promotes what you're offering. Your landing page is where you can find both what you're offering and your hook. When a tourist clicks on the ad, the landing page says, Hey, glad you came. This is what we're offering you. 2. Build your landing page as follows. Create the listing on your website and give it a distinct subdirectory URL, like yoursite.com slash content name. Delete the web navigation if at all necessary. Having no site navigation has been shown to improve conversion rates, while the user remains based on what you are offering. The copy should be straightforward and succinct, with a compelling call to action. Speak in the voice of the client. Use a bullet list to describe the benefits. To establish familiarity, use the same image on your landing page and Facebook ad. 3. Create your monitoring URL. A monitoring URL may be set up for Google Analytics or a variety of other predictive providers. 4. Create your budget. We'd be remiss if we didn't notice that every kind of ad campaign, including Facebook advertising, carries risk. So you can only participate if you believe the risk is worth the return. Of course, we should point out that in order to optimize your ROI, you must be willing to take certain risks. You can run a $50 per day ad campaign or a $500 per day ad campaign. The amount you spend on Facebook ad campaigns is completely up to you. You can begin by experimenting with a small amount of capital. It works by turning off the advertisements after you've spent your daily allowance. 5. Configure your Facebook ad. The most critical aspect of your Facebook ad is the title. Give it the respect it deserves. Make sure to use the vocabulary of your target audience, such as learn how or click here to do this. But you must decide what will elicit the desired response from your target audience. Image is worth a thousand words, and they're absolutely right. Make sure your image tells anything. Facebook ad only allows for a call to action headline and a two line summary. 6. Make the ad more specific. Facebook allows you to target people based on their preferences and desires. You can make your ad reach as many people as the number of people who live within a certain radius of your market. This could be the millions or as little as a few thousand. This is especially true if you want to meet people between the ages of 18 and 19 who like white chocolate chip cookies and live within 5 miles of your establishment. You can even adjust the goal settings when you're on the go. So, if you aren't seeing the click-through you anticipated, you can easily adjust the settings to boost the target audience. 7. Examine and adjust. Although it is necessary to review and change if appropriate, you do not want to get overwhelmed with the analytics. Please be careful and be patient. It allows you to chat with your friends when surfing the site get updated, share content, 
upload photographs, and change your status from anywhere. Twitter. Twitter is a microblogging site. Twitter was originally intended to be compliant with mobile phones via text messaging, which is why each Twitter post is limited to 140 characters. Suggestions for marketing on Twitter. Participate in social media for the CEO. Social networking is an ideal way to converse with the target demographic, make connections, and manage certain connections with clients, prospects, bloggers, and so on. However, for a CEO, the typical routes to social media can be difficult, particularly in larger businesses. In general, a CEO doesn't have time to write a blog, respond to a large number of tweets, or cope with a large number of friend requests on Facebook. Twitter is a way to avoid all of those difficulties. It's short and easy. Since Twitter updates are limited to 140 characters, it is all about brief thoughts and remarks. If you can send a text message, you can use Twitter as a marketing tool from anywhere in the world. Remain in contact with bloggers or media. It's easy to join anyone on Twitter. Twitter and how often they decide to follow you up. Check in on your business or name on Twitter. You'll be able to see what's working and what isn't through tracking, and you'll be able to make the requisite adjustments. Announcements of specials, discounts, or offers. If you frequently have exclusive offers, Twitter can be used to automatically broadcast these discounts. Events are being updated in real time. If you attend business meetings or trade shows, you can use Twitter to announce the case, last minute updates, and more. It's a fantastic last minute publicity tool. A step-by-step -step guide to marketing on Twitter. One, create an account and create a profile. Go to www.twitter.com and choose the Get Started Join option. Follow the sign-up instructions. Two, write updates. Twitter's overall character limit of 140 characters is a perfect equalizer. There is no way for one article to outdo another, so just write something. Three, make new friends. On Twitter, making new friends is a breeze. Simply browse Facebook pages, favorite sites, and so forth. And when you see a Twitter box, click on it to go to their profile. You're now watching them after clicking the Join tab. 4. Instructions for posting URLs If you have a very long URL, you may not have enough space for a limit of 140 characters. In this case, you can use www.tinyurl.com to convert a long URL to a short URL. 5. Listen in on discussions about the business. Even if you don't have a Twitter account, you can easily follow what people are talking about a business, brand, or individual. This is very valuable in marketing. Use the at symbol before someone's Twitter username while chatting. This turns the username into a gateway to their profile, allowing others to join in on the chat. For example, if you said, at name here, thanks for the fab details on Twitter today, you'd be able to say the person you enjoyed what they wrote. YouTube. YouTube is a media network as well as a video website. Messages can be officially shared through a variety of mediums, including Twitter and Facebook, thanks to the user-friendly format of YouTube. There's no need for a particular audience to watch a YouTube video that you can instantly and conveniently add to your channel, Facebook account, Twitter account, and so on. More than 500 tweets a minute have a link to a YouTube video, and YouTube search bar is the second most used on the internet behind only Google. YouTube receives 3 billion hours of collective use each month, indicating that it has the ability to be an effective social media marketing platform. So, as a marketer in charge of a media division, here's how to make the most of YouTube. Create your own channel. YouTube helps you to tailor your channel to match your branding, as well as highlight the videos you choose to highlight. You have control over which video appears first and how the content appears. When you sign up for YouTube, you're agreeing to provide a channel right away. You'll personalize your platform by including a content summary. When you log in, you'll see a menu where you can configure a channel. Content Curation You can use YouTube to manage content across all of your channels without ever adding a new file. Keyword searches can be used to search by length, type, functionality, upload date, and other criteria. To begin, select a few videos that you want to add to your channel. You should make a playlist or a favorite list, and then organize the videos using the playlist settings. Original Material 
It's not necessary to have a dedicated media staff to make successful content. To make a simple video, all you need is a digital camera or a mobile phone with video capability. To maximize targeted traffic, make how-to posts, interview influential people, build product tips, and so on. Get found. The search engines will index YouTube videos, but they will not be able to decide the content. To ensure that surfers can identify your channel, make sure your videos and channel are correctly tagged. Describe your channel and take special note of the video titles you choose. Chapter 4. 31 Ways to Use YouTube for Your Business Advertising and Marketing 1. Create a channel that reflects your brand and allows you to communicate with others. 2. Showcase the product in motion with a catchy movie trailer theme. 3. Choose a username that represents your brand for your channel URL. 4. Make a video that explains the product or service. 5. Including the channel's URL in your ads and social media profiles. 6. Posting video testimonials for customers will help you gain popularity. 7. Show the results of others that have used your product or service. 8. To advertise the activities, use tapes of prior events. 9. Let audiences on a tour of the offices to make them feel more at ease. 10. Request that others use your commodity in their films. 11. Run a contest. 12. Don't be afraid to advertise several brands at the same time. 13. Introduce the team to add credibility. 14. Share links to your videos on different social media platforms. 15. To hit the target market, consider using YouTube promoted content. 16. Make use of Google AdWords. These are text-based advertisements that do not include a video from your company. 17. By working with YouTube, you can earn money from your posts. Google Analytics can be used to examine the success of your channel. In each film, provide company details such as name, address, and phone number. 18. URL, email address, and phone number are all needed. Leadership and experience. 19. Presentation slides should be shared. 20. Upload videos of presentations you've provided to show authority. 21. Formalize conduct an interview with a subject matter specialist in your field. 22. Formalize build brief videos with useful advice for your customer to demonstrate your skills. 23. Formalize by converting your podcasts into videos. You can reach a wider audience. 24. Leave feedback to interact with the YouTube crowd. 25. Make a video of an important meeting to share with colleagues. Service to customers. 26. Share answers to popular product or service issues. 27. Make how-to tutorials to assist your clients with using your product or service. 28. Have videos on your website. 29. Use videos to answer customer-specific questions. 30. Build visual help by including a video in a blog post that discusses a topic. 31. Take it a step further by including closed captions in your videos. Thank you for watching. Please help to subscribe to this channel and share it with your friends. The next upcoming video, we'll be talking about 1. 5 social media tips for e-commerce marketing. 2. Understanding the playing field of social media marketing. By the way, if you also want to have the text version of these video series, you can refer to the download instructions that's stated in the description.